in the previous video we saw uh, how to add the entry conditions for the 920 straddle we will now add our stop loss and target conditions in order to add the stop loss and target conditions i will be using something called repair condition so i will add a repair out here and i will select and in my condition builder i'll click on add and i will select a keyword which is traded instrument using this keyword i will fetch the uh, i'll fetch the pnl of the um, of the call leg so i am selecting my condition type as entry the field as pnl underlying will be nifty 50 i'll select my set as 1 condition as 1 and leg as 1 so this will look at the pnl of the uh, of the call leg your i want to build a stop loss so i will select less than and out here i'll select number so since i want a stop loss of 500 rupees i will select my keyword as minus 500 and click on okay i will also multiply this by the multiplier of the strategy so uh, in one of our previous videos we have discussed about multiplier we would suggest you have a look at that video to know better about what exactly is a multiplier in addition to uh, the 500 rupees stop loss i can also keep a 1000 rupee target so in order to build my target i'll simply copy paste the same traded instrument keyword and i will use number and within number instead of minus 500 i'll select 1000 rupees and i will again multiply this by the multiplier and this entire condition will be an or condition so if my call leg gives me 1000 rupees in profit or 500 rupees in loss i will exit the call position and then i click on submit after submitting this i will add the position builder of the same uh here i want to buy uh, i want to square off my call leg and i'll select nifty 50 my strike will be fx and expiry will be current week and quantity will be one lot uh i'm selecting fx and expiry because i want to select the traded instrument which was my call leg so i want to find the same uh, the strike price of the of the call leg which was traded in my entry condition and i will select my underlying as nifty i'll select set 1 condition 1 leg 1 and i'll click on okay and i'll click on submit and i will add this position and i will close the position builder so you can see my repair once leg has now been um has now been created successfully so i have now built my target and stop loss for the call leg now i want to build my target and stop loss for the put leg and my put leg is the second instrument in the entry condition so since i want to fetch this particular instrument i will now add one more repair condition so i'll click on add and i will simply copy and paste these conditions that i had already generated and i will click on edit with an edit you see everywhere it has used traded instrument with number as 111 since i want to look at the put instrument i will click on traded instrument and i will change this leg number to 2 and that will look at my put instrument similarly in the second row also i will change the leg number as 2 to add my target and stop loss for the put instrument i will close this and now i will add my position builder i'll select exchange as nfo instrument type will be put underlying will be nifty 50 my product will be normal strike as i mentioned previously i'll select fx and then i'll click on the fx button and use traded instrument within traded instrument i want to fetch the strike price of the put leg of nifty 50 I select set one, condition one, and leg number two, and I click on OK, and I will submit this. Then I will close this dialog box. Select current week and lot cells one, and I will click on add. After closing this, 
my strategy is pretty much ready. I've added the repair once conditions, which are my targets and stop loss. In the next video, I will be discussing how to configure your advanced settings and the universal exit. So stay tuned for that.